Yeah, and now two years later, words like COVID, COVID protocols all have tremendous meaning. For one school district, it's now the focus of a dispute that may lead to teachers walking off their jobs. Today in the Bay, Sharon Katsuda is live for us this morning. And Sharon, schools everywhere really are struggling with pandemic problems, but especially this school. That's right, Kira. This comes at a time when school districts statewide are dealing with teacher shortages. More than 100 staff members in the Oakland Unified School District tested positive for COVID last week. The president of the teachers union says the remaining teachers showing up to work are stretched thin and they're calling on the district to hire more support staff. The union president says he's authorized to call a strike within the next 48 hours, but parents are worried for what it could mean for them. Whether they're sick outs or strikes or anything like that, it's incredibly disruptive for parents, especially parents who don't have the luxury right now to still work from home and who rely on school as child care. The meetings are scheduled to continue. Meantime, statewide school districts are dealing with school closures because of lack of staffing due to COVID. This prompted Governor Newsom recently to say there may be a need for an extended school year to make up for the loss in instruction. Last year, K through 12 schools accounted for about 18% of workplace outbreaks in California. Schools outpaced healthcare facilities for COVID-19 outbreaks in the fall. Palo Alto Unified School District recruited 800 parent volunteers to fill in as teacher aides for when classrooms are combined due to teacher shortages. And it's very interesting because the Oakland Unified School District situation is definitely evolving. Students, some students there calling for a Zoom meeting at 1030 today to talk about their concerns over COVID. But of course, this is during school hours when most students should be in school. So it'll be interesting to see how many people turn out for that school, that Zoom meeting. Reporting live, I'm Sharon Katsuda, Today in the Bay.